All right, here's something uh, that uh, I've been having an issue with uh, for the past, well, since I've had it, really. Uh, I noticed whenever I would hit record um, on a track, you know, as I was recording, um, I would see the waveform data being um, recorded as I was recorded, but then after I stopped pressing record, um, I just get this blank line. You know, first I thought it was maybe this, you know, I didn't have the waveform thing turned on, but I turned that on, drag it all the way up to kind of, you know, beef up the, the, the size of the waveform. Nothing, right? So I'm going to take that down. Um, but let me solo this because there is audio on this track. So I'm going to start it. Uh, let's unsolo it. And start it right here. Hey, devil. You ain't on my level. You should be cool, but I found somebody better, devil. So there is waveform data. There's, there's audio data, but there's no waveform to show it, which makes it pretty much um, impossible to edit, you know, because, you know, you need to see that, that data represented. Uh, in order to you know know if you need to cut something, where you need to cut it, if it's a breath, if it's a, a bad note or a tongue click or whatever, lip smack or a breath or whatever, you know you need to be able to see that waveform data, and then that's a glitch that's pretty well reported. And there's a fix for it in in Logic Nine. You know there was an option thing up here in the bar that you would go to, and you would you know go to uh, refresh audio file but there is not uh, an option uh, here in X that's uh, visible you know um, there's not there's not one in here in X that's visible so uh, I just started poking around the program and found this uh, and, I, and I finally found it uh, but it's in an arbitrary place that you would not uh, expect it to be and I think you have to click here on uh, browsers right and so now you have uh, and if it's on any anything else like media or all files you just need to click on project that way you can see all of the audio files in your project and all of the, the waveform data or what have you that's representative of it so as you can see it, it mirrors that which you see in the main arrangement window there is no waveform data sh showed so what I'm going to do is do a command A and select all of these audio files in the project section and I found it here under audio file and refresh overviews then you get this little message And I'm going to click faster. And boom. As you can see, they're starting to show up. It's just going through, um, showing all of the waveform da data. And just waiting because I got a lot of files. I got a lot of audio files in this project. Uh, you'll see here once I zoom out. All right, so now that's done and I can close my browser And then zoom out and boom There are now instead of all of the blanks that I had before I have all of my waveform uh, Data and that is the fix for logic pro X on how to do that uh, So uh, just like subscribe, you know share this video, you know how it goes um, it's your boy, your nephew, your cousin, John Williams. Holla at me.